Now, I know some of you were saying, you swatted that bird. These birds, if they fly, are just gonna fly straight up into a tree and then sit there and look at you. We try and shoot them on the fly every once in a while, but. No, there's a fourth one. Get it? Yep. I hope there's no more. I'm out of shells. What? There's another one. I'm out of shells. There's another one again down the road that flew up, but it went way on in. I lost this one right here somewhere. I think this one went in. Uh, I'm going to go out here on another bird hunt just down uh, about seven kilometers down this trail behind camp. Uh, on the other side of camp from where I shot that cow yesterday. Uh, but seven kilometers down that way, just on a bird hunt. Maybe I'll see something, bring in the rifle as well, just in case. Uh, let see if I can't film my five birds. And then we're going to have them for dinner tonight, I believe. Along with some other ones we've got. So, join me. Let's have some fun. Okay. 
wheel. So up here, you got these, which I'm pretty sure are rough grouse. Them and sharp tails look so similar. You really need to know what you're doing to tell them apart. We got these guys, which are pretty sure are rough grouse. And then you've got spruce grouse, which I think I shot one the other day that you guys might have seen. Uh, they're black. Look very, very similar, but they're black instead of that brown. And so, limits are rough and spruce, a combined for, in this area, a combined for five daily limit and 15 possession limit. And then the sharp tails have their own five and 15. But again, you really need to be able to know what you're talking about to tell the difference. And I'm not that good, so I just, I shoot five birds and that's that. All right, let's go. I can't tell, but I think there's a bird in the road. Yep, there is a bird in the road. Right up there in the middle. Looks like another rocky. Rockies can be really, really skittish. before he goes to take off. Oh, oh shit. Oh, quit twitching. That's just... Oh. Yeah. That's just nerves. He did. Good bird. Yeah. What was my grandfather? He used to call them uh, forest chickens. Because they don't fly. They just run. If they're gonna fly, it's up into that branch up there, and then they're gonna sit there and look at you. And you shoot them out of the tree and get them off the ground. Anyway, that's three now. Not bad. Safety back on. Gun in the boot. Shell back in the bag. Let's keep going. All right, those are my three birds. Uh, the, like you said, you guys saw the fourth, or you might not have, I don't know. I just about run him over, and then he took off at a dead run into the into just some thick brush. I lost him. I went and took a small look for him. But, whoo, just back into camp. Nobody else is here. I knew Chase and Ivan had left, but apparently Cash and Dad did too. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll go back in that same cut where I shot that cow and see if I have any luck in there or maybe I'll just hang around camp for a little bit and rest up a little no no real rush on anything so I'll keep you guys updated All right. let's go for bird Two birds. 
Woohoo! Make sure this is unloaded here in a second. Safety on. Gun down. Not bad. 410 can still do it. There's a third bird. There's a third bird. I just saw it in the woods. It's over there. Straight ahead of me. for the 410 but it did the trick good thing I took another look around that's awesome Woo! another one to the pile again safety on Gun's empty. Safety's back on. All right, I got two more birds. And then my limit's full. All right. Let's keep moving. German bolt action shotgun. You guys can see it. Been in my family over a hundred years. God, is it deadly. Ooh. I just about cut his head right off. I'm gonna come watch. trees was planted they in straight rows oh. you see the one on your side ready one two three see a lot of feathers and his leg ain't in the right spot I aimed above his head and his legs still fucked up just short of a three-man limit not bad not bad get all these flayed up good to go get them vacuum sealed this little bolt action gun, all we know is it says, let's focus, Germany on the barrel, and that we've got pictures of our great-great-grandfather with it when he was a young man, back in the early 1900s. So, at least 100 years old, it's been in the family that long. It's killed a pile of birds, pile of deer. And it will continue, no, well, maybe not deer anymore, but it'll continue to kill birds any, anyway. Well, that's
that's all she wrote for Moose Camp 2022. And now we're on the road, chasing Ivan out ahead of us. We got a few birds left in our limit. So see if we can't maybe score one or two more out. Other than that, here comes 2,000 kilometers of, yeah, pretty much just misery. So I won't bore you with too much of it, a shot here and there. Other than that, I'll see you when we get back home.